In this video, we'll convert 0.4 moles of PbNO3 to, to grams. This is lead to nitrate. And this 0.4 number, that's just something I made up for the video. So we have our 0.4 moles of lead to nitrate. And when we go from moles to grams, so we're going from moles to grams, we're going to multiply by the molar mass. And that will give us the grams. So we'll multiply by the molar mass for PbNO3 too. If you need help calculating that, there's a link in the description of this video to show you how to do that. So we have 331.2 grams per mole. The unit for molar mass, that's grams per mole. So we multiply, we have moles on top and the bottom. They cancel out, that gives us grams. That's what we're looking for. So we know we set it up correctly. We multiply and get 132.5 grams of lead to nitrate. To recap, we wanted to go from moles to grams. So we had our moles, we wanted to go to grams, so we multiplied by the molar mass. That gave us grams of lead to nitrate. If we were given grams and asked to find moles, we'd start with grams, then we divide by the molar mass, and that would give us moles of our lead to nitrate here. This is Dr. B converting from moles of lead to nitrate to grams. Thanks for watching.